Hear this. The time has come to get the balance right. The reality is, if you have language that is too wide, too general, it has a chilling effect on free speech. We need to restore confidence to the Racial Discrimination Act and to the Human Rights Commission's administration of it. Is there anybody here committed to stopping me from doing it? Let's slow it down. Let's slow it way down. We know that the language of agency at the moment has lost its credibility. Are you sure you ain't just being paranoid? There is no legal right not to be offended. We aren't snowflakes as human beings. We do need to be a bit more robust. Can I get you some coffee? Or how about a blanket? Harassment is a more powerful, more powerful language. Well, hell, I, say, I guess I ain't never looked at it like that before. Our goal is to persuade the Senate to pass the legislation. No one said a job's supposed to be easy. No one said it's supposed to be that hard, neither. We're often asked about our prospects in the Senate. Sometimes we're given free predictions. Sometimes they're wrong. <laughs> The government needs to answer one question. What is it that they want to be allowed to say that they're not allowed to say now? You're starting to see pictures, ain't you? But I believe we have got this right. That's the only thing you've said that's the truth. The only time black folks are safe is when white folks is disarmed. And this had the desired effect of disarming white folks. Mm, thanks for the editorial. I call it a dirty trick. What's the matter, John Rue? I hurt your feelings.